weekend. It's our weekly trip to the doctors. Woo! <laughs> That's about as exciting as it gets at the moment. Well, so, well, unless something happens on the way, I'll like come across a, I don't know, a crash or something. Mm -hmm. He's morbid, he is. No, nah, not really. Nah. Um, yeah, so it's another day. As I say, another day, another dollar. Other than we don't find the dollars. Other than, yeah, other than we don't find the dollars. But yeah, we're just off to the doctors to get our weekly medication. And we've got to go to b and I think Lily said, to get a piece of wood yeah. to put over the top of our bedroom door because we've got like glass panels there and the light comes through and it's really bloody annoying. But other than that, obviously Kenzie's in the back there somewhere. Hello. And there's Lee. Good evening, good morning, and goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Hi guys. Welcome, 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 one and all. I'm in one of them weird moods. Yeah, you're in one of them weird moods today, aren't you? I am. He's in one of them weird moods today. So the video should get interesting. But can you- that's where do you want to go? <laughs> See what I mean? Bloody hell! <clears throat> um, we just dropped Katie and Jay off at school and then realised we had to come back because Lee's um, blue badge had run out. So obviously we had to go and get his new one. And I had to go and get my sunglasses. You told me to go and get his sunglasses. Which I didn't have to go and get because Which I had them Which I thought long. was indoors, but he said they're not in my bag. And I said to all, they must be. He said they're not. So I went indoors, I looked for them, I couldn't find them. And I'm not going in that house on my own again because I heard talking. I heard talking. We have some weird ghostly voices in that house and it's just it's just really creepy. So yeah, come well, back we, out. I said find my glasses. I come back out, said to him I said to him, I can't find your sunglasses. I said I've looked everywhere and he said to me, he said, hold on a minute, I'll check my bag again. So he checked his bag and what did you find babe? Oh, part of my spine. <laughs> no, um, it was my glasses. I remember taking them out because I had to get my power bank out and I never put the glasses back in. <laughs> you know, these things happen. It's a hack, hack accident. So yeah, that's obviously what's happened so far. And we are now driving to the doctors and we'll catch up with you in a little while. So guys, as you can see, um, obviously at the moment we're at the doctor's. Um, we've got here, um, Louise is just doing her bit. Um, obviously getting all the prescriptions and everything, picking all them up. But what I've done is at the moment, I'm in the back of the van, as you can probably see. Obviously that's the front, uh, Kenzie down there. Um, there's my chair, that's where, it, that's where it lives, my little chair. Um, so what I'm doing is the other day, we actually bought, and if I can move Kenzie's body out of the way, um, what we did is, oh, and he's, he's okay. um, we bought these little handy little boxes. Um, we've got two of them. Uh, because what we got fed up with, we got fed up with every, obviously everybody keep throwing stuff. Oh, like I really wanted to see that as you went past. What? Yeah, look, got all the food. Oh. oh. Yuck. <laughs> Yuck. Um, yeah, sorry guys. <laughs> so what I was going to do is while I'm here, I'm just going to get one of these boxes. And huh? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, oops. Louise is back. Oh dear, I got caught. What are you doing? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I just kind of like where you got? Uh language. Sorry. <laughs> language, Timothy. Sorry. I can't get it. Ken's. Yeah. Can you get that apart? Because I can't do it. I've only got one hand. I want one of them boxes, but not the other. I want the empty one. That's it. Thank you. Right, so, yeah, so what we did was we bought these boxes. I want the one with the gravy. Because that's just the way I am. Thank you very much. No, the grey one matches my car. What? The grey one matches my car. Well, that. Yeah, but that's cream not... doesn't exactly go with a big blue van, does it? Not a grey. Well, it's better with blue than it is. Alright, okay. <laughs> 
fuck, I'm sorry. Do you know what, people? I'm not even going to argue on this one. I feel you don't listen, you're a bloody man. I'm not even going to argue. Why did I just do it? What a div. You ain't going to believe what I just did. What did you do? Huh? Right. So both of them boxes, yeah, are identical. Right? Yeah. Yeah. But I've just took the lids off both of them. Yeah. And took the contents from one yeah. and put it into the other one. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Why did I do that? It's only the lid that's different. <laughs> the boxes are identical, they're exactly the same. So all I had to do was just carry on using the same box I had in my hand and put the other lid on it. But no, I put that box down, emptied all the stuff into it. It could you a big <sighs> Brain, this is what she does to me, people. Oh, don't you blame me for Right, so anyway, what we was trying to do is, she's gone again. Where was she gone? Where's she? Where is she going now? Oh, I don't know. So anyway, the idea was, we got these boxes, obviously like this so that all of the stuff that's like floating around that we want to keep in the van because we've got like inverters um like power inverters and all, all other stuff what like leads and stuff well i wanted to put them in that box so that's what i am going to do now so guys i'm back now i've got all the medication as you just kind of watched, obviously, Lee explained about the boxes that he got. Yeah, I've got a joke for you guys. What as I? No, not at what as I. <laughs> Going wrong. What as he is, but don't listen. I know. I say my husband don't listen. What's your answer? Comment below. Right, guys. So I finished my breakfast. Obviously, <laughs> Lee spilling my tea all over me. Um, just drinking my tea. And Lee and Kenzie are just getting the wheelchair out of the van. Hello. And we're going to pop in Asda because the boys need the toilet. Mm. Don't you? Yeah. And obviously when Kenzie needs the toilet, he needs to go because... Is your blood tie, Kenz? How did that work? What? Just switch that. So yeah, we're just going to go in Asda. I want to have a look at the Easter stuff. Um, because as most of you will know now, I want to make Easter a little bit special for the girl, for the That's girls and weird. Kenzie this year. You just took that up. And <laughs> obviously, that because as you know, obviously on Easter Sunday this year, we were originally meant to be sitting in a villa around our own private pool. But because of COVID, we can't. So I'm going to make Easter a little bit special for the, for the girls and Kenzie this year. Um, maybe spoil them a little bit. But... Yeah, I'm a bit gutted, but hey-ho, it is what it is, and we'll just rebook when we can. But, yeah, I'm just going to obviously finish my tea, and then we're going to go in there. Okay, guys, so this is where we actually find out how much this little lady here has spent. So, here we go. Actually, I'll go around... It's one pound. Yeah. Around this side. Yeah. Let me go around this side. Get right. That's it here. I can get a better view. <laughs> Gotta stop that. Huh? Got Try and stop that. It's alright, don't worry guys, I'm not doing anything. I'm just trying to stop that flashing. Mm -hmm. You're not gonna stop it. I can. Like that. There you go, I'll stop the flashing. Sorry. See how we get on. Pardon? It's actually got a security tag on it. Oh, of course, yeah, it's a <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen that before. Have you done? No. Have you seen that, guys? Look, obviously, it just come up. It's made this really weird noise. Uh, this is how desperate things are getting that they have to put <laughs> security tags on a packet of steak. <laughs> 
That been me taking the steak off and no. putting it back. Don't get this lady. No, I'm not. Don't worry. There you go. Thank you. <laughs> Ouch. I'm not looking forward to this total. It's going to be real. Renzi's yeah, but it's not even going to be. I see what she's going to do, so she's going to come up with all of this big total and she's going to blame it on Ken's car. Sorry about the flashing in the background, I'm trying to stop it. Just trying to put something over the lens to stop the flashing. It just shows you what a camera picks up that your eyes don't see. So we're getting there. I'm not looking forward to this time. <laughs> Hang on a minute, did that have a tag on it as well? What? Did that? Oh, look at me, have a tag on it. What? Um, I don't know. No, I didn't. Sorry. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. So remember that total guys, at the moment we are on £37.78. No, okay. Oh no, 41 so. Right, so guys, grand total in mainly little Easter things. Trim paper and stuff. <laughs> so there you go, that's how much a little lady can spend in Oh, I'm <laughs> okay guys so we'll show you obviously the way we pack <laughs> and the way we pack this is the way we pack shopping no this is the way Lee packs shopping oh, I oh I can't reach anymore <laughs> I can't reach this is the one that I'm thinking of getting boo. Oh yeah. I mean, nice giving one. it up to us. I think she'll like that. Yeah, Aha! One of these pink ones didn't have the tag on it. Even you've started to throw stuff in there. No, it didn't. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys, so that is um that is the shopping done at Asda. Planned shopping trip at that. No, it wasn't planned. Never is with me though. But then neither is 90% of our 50 odd pounds shopping sprees are never planned either. Kenzie's so, really Yeah, Kenzie had a pair of bunny ears on and was bouncing up and down. Yes, I thought that was funny. Ears on though. Oh, so now he's now he ain't got bunny. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Here he goes. <laughs> and you see what we have to live with. <laughs> well, He's not this is what we live with. He's not a normal restaurant, <laughs> guys. And they reckon he can go to a mainstream school. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> You're beaten up, we're in about an hour. <laughs> Hello guys, so we're back in the van now. Don't worry, 
I don't know what to do with the posh accent. Yeah, we're back in the van accent. now, we're the and we're going over to B and Q to get some wood. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. I don't know what that accent was about, but I'm just in a cheerful mood. The warm weather's coming, and I'm getting new boots today. So we're in B and Q now, and Lee's obsessed with this little light here. Yeah, this one. Room. It's actually quite pretty, but obviously he said he could feel it vibrating if you run his finger kind of round there, but... But it's everywhere. Wherever I put my finger, I didn't feel it, it felt like it was vibrating. So, we've got the monkey monkey with us. <laughs> He's in a funny mood. What's that? Fire has... Dad, that's your what? son! Don't be so horrible! <laughs> Fire hazard or what? Right, so fire guys, hazard. this Lee calls this a fire hazard, but I don't know if you can see. <laughs> it's like a furry light. It's got, it's got a cover, it's got like a paper shade around it, and then it's feathers stuck on the outside. It's awful though. I won't pay, pay, I won't pay four quid for that. Like, like, it's a light up chicken. It's a light up chicken. So they do some really nice lights in this. where we got our bedroom light from. Obviously, once we do our complete room tour, because our new bed's turning up tomorrow. Um, so once we do our complete room tour, Obviously, you'll get to see like it yeah, completed. We're not looking forward to later on. Obviously, we're all yeah. We've got we've tonight. got to sleep downstairs tonight because we've got to take our old bed apart, ready for tomorrow. Because they're coming in between eight and eleven oh, do you tomorrow. Sleep downstairs tonight? Yeah. You can keep an eye on them. I can also keep an eye on you. Not sneaking down in the middle of the no, night. No, no, them in the morning when they get up. Not going on the phone. Yeah. yeah so Saturday we're on anyway. Oh, is it? So Lee's looking at these, he keeps going on the back getting them and in the van. It's got a PIR sensor. <laughs> <laughs> so they'll only come on and off. When it's you get quite them expensive on. though, that's like only mm. five meters, and I hey, I've got 20 meters for that price. Yeah, that is, is a bit expensive. Oh no. Four-way um, adapter. We could have lights going all different directions. Oh god. <laughs> look, these, these are quite expensive, look, these are the... So guys, I found what I need. This big bit of plywood. Lee's got to cut it down. Or I've got to cut it down one or two. Oh, they've got some more over there. Um, oh, are they? So, yeah, it's a bit of plywood. It's white one side and brown the other. And it's three millimeter pie. Oh, yeah, I'm just looking over here, but these are big bits of ply. Big, massive bits of plywood. Wow! Yep, yeah, they're too big, you're yeah, right. Yeah. I've already got. So they're all different sizes, look. Big sheet, little sheet. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we have to put up with guys when we go to the shop. Is, is he even ready? <laughs> I don't know, but it's like embarrassing. Um, there's a plane. There's a plane. Quick, let's kick the plane. Yeah, the There's a plane. <laughs> <laughs> plane crash. What? How narrow them planks are. Yeah. Loft ladder. So we got what we needed, yeah. and then we're going to get out of as quick as I can because obviously, if Lee sees loads of tools, obviously. That's when he starts buying and stuff, or trying to get me to buy stuff that he doesn't need. That's a lot of Yeah, that'd be too big. That's no. That's the type where you it so that it comes down instead of goes up, which would be much easier. My new home. Right, Kenzie's staying here now. She <laughs> comes with the door night and everything. Night. Just found a new home. Oh. Right, stay you there. You get me loft insulation so you get to come to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Welcome to. Just kick that board. Well, at least it went your head. Stop moaning. <laughs> oh, you would <laughs> not do that. <laughs> yeah, so we got what we want, and I'm getting out of here because Kenzie's driving me insane. Okay, good. That, that's what I like to see. Look, being Q's car park, the dilemma of getting a eight by four sheet. Into a little car. It's like 
it's like the fun of watching ikea isn't it people trying to get all their furniture in the back of a mini <laughs> at ikea yeah. <laughs> it just doesn't happen it just doesn't work hi right, guys we just got back to the van and we're just watching a, a couple over there they've got a, what car is it it <laughs> is it's a peugeot 20 something they've got a peugeot car he can't even turn the steering he can't drive like that he can't even turn the steering wheel and they've got a bit a big bit of board in the car and they're trying to work out how the wife or girlfriend or woman's going to get in the car he's got it wedged up against the steering wheel he's more than likely going to get stopped unless he lives pretty close i hope he does you've got a car right behind you no no so yeah we're just going to head home now because kenzie's getting on my poxy nerves can you hear him in the back <laughs> right, he's not having Capri Suns anymore. Huh? He's not getting fresh air anymore if he carries on like that. So, we're going to go home because it's going to be the time we get home. It's like, it's five to one now. By the time we get home, it's going to be pretty much time to go get KDJ from school. Yep. And then it's the weekend. And as I said earlier, our new bed's turning up tomorrow morning. I'm proper, proper excited about that. Are you excited about our new bed turning up? Hmm? You excited about our new bed turning up? Go yep. that way. Pretty yeah, easier. I am. Never. Oh, that is a car coming. <laughs> it's too far back. So, I'm yeah, just... we're proper excited about that turning up. Um... Here he comes, he's come down the side of us. He can't even drive that with it. It's just... It's wedged up against the steering wheel. That's what so, I said. He's gonna, he's gonna decapit he goes around the corner too far, he's gonna decapitate the two of them. <laughs> so, we're gonna. Kill me! Obviously, Lee's gonna hit the brakes before he kills someone. <laughs> no, I'm just gonna uh, push the The bed is being delivered between 8 and 11 tomorrow, but the price we paid for it, it was about £69 delivery. And it includes um, installation and like make like building it. So we're kind of looking forward to that. So we only got to build our new bed. Um, it does it all for you. So we'll catch up with you in a little while. Alright, so guys, I stopped at the garage because I needed a drink. Um, and I've got a can of Pepsi. Lee got the same. And obviously Kenzie got a can of Pepsi Max because he's diabetic and he can't actually you're supposed to have Pepsi Max now yeah I won't drink it and you won't drink it though so watch his blood shoot up later hey if you want me to stop if you want me to stop drinking pe like Pepsi and Coke and stuff like that that's fine I can do that do you all you're going to do is keep buying you just have to buy me milk wherever we go milk yeah because it'll only be the only cold drink that I'll drink fair enough I suppose that's an alternative. I've never thought of that before. I've never actually thought of that before. Yeah, see, you so you see, see, Lee just said that he's quite happy to drink like a pint of milk. Where me personally, I don't actually like milk. I'll, I'll drink milk in like um, cereal and in tea and hot chocolate, but I don't actually physically like a glass of milk. I can't remember if anyone else is like that because. There's a lot of people who actually like that. They, they'll have it in tea and stuff, but they won't actually drink it as a glass of milk. Where Lee, he said he will. Yeah. So, um, yeah, we're on our way home, and the roads are quite quiet actually, which is quite surprising. Isn't it? Quiet than I thought. It's like twenty past one. 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 <laughs> Where are you going, Northern? I don't know. Uh, it's 20 past one and by the time we get home it's going to be time to go get a little lady from school. She's got dressed as a soldier today because obviously it's superhero day and like we said to her, soldiers are heroes aren't they? They are, absolutely. And I said to her on the way into school, I said what do soldiers do? She went, they fight <laughs> for our country. <laughs> <laughs> He's been watching too much Casper Sight. <laughs> so Casper Sight, if you see this, he's absolutely lovely mate. <laughs> Freaky deaky. Freaky deaky. <laughs> so, yeah, basically, yeah, um, 
I said to her this morning that she went into school, I said, so what do soldiers do? Why are soldiers superheroes? She said, because they fight for our country, mummy. So I'm actually quite proud of her. I was reading similar. It's carrying a cake. Because they carry a big gun. <laughs> Two hours later. So guys, obviously I'm just on my way to get Katie a J from school and there's heck of a load of traffic so I'm gonna go around the shortcut whether it's gonna be any quicker or not I'm not sure it's turned out really really warm um, we were just taking our old bed apart because I knew one's being delivered and built tomorrow and uh, looking forward to that so yeah I'll be back once I'm at the school so that was that was a lot quicker I went around the shortcut normally it takes longer because no one will let you out the side road but obviously I managed to kind of get out it's a case of just pulling out in front of them and had no choice one wouldn't let me out he was being ignorant um, but yeah I got out and I'm now at the traffic lights and these lights are an absolute bloody nightmare they they let about three cars through and this is a very busy junction so as you can imagine like at school pick up and drop off times it's very busy and it don't let a lot of cars through so basically sitting there for ages but yeah it paid off today it doesn't always pay off but it did today right so i am now at a little lady's school um it is currently two 2.48 she finishes in about half an hour but like I've said in the past you have to get up here early um, because otherwise you can't get a parking space and if you want a disabled space you even get up the room earlier because people just abuse them and the school won't do nothing about it we've had numerous arguments over the years about the disabled spaces but hey ho it is what it is what can you do if the school won't do nothing? You just have to kind of have to try and live with it. But yeah, so I'm at school now. Um, I'm just gonna post our old bed on Facebook and try and get rid of that. And then pick little lady up and back home. Right, so I have just gone in and picked a little lady up and i'm going to show you she's a superhero <laughs> a superhero soldier isn't you mm. huh? so you good at school yeah yeah so i've just told her about a new book i've bought her and obviously i normally get her an lol but excuse the redness it's like really hot here all of a sudden then we get her an lol but obviously she just opens them and then don't play with them so i got her a book instead that she can read so do you want to talk Hold the camera. Can you drop yourself in, please? You're gonna rip it. So we're just gonna head home now, and we'll see you when we get back. So, guys, we are now home, and as you can see, we are bedless. <laughs> we're bedless. This is bedlam. <laughs> and Sienna's decided she's gonna lay all over the floor. She's in a bit of a weird mood. She, she's just been sitting up in the loft to put some stuff up there. And Can you rephrase that? What? We did not send our kids up into the loft. I didn't just send her up in the loft. I did ask her if okay, she would right. mind going in the loft because okay. I can't get up there. And she agreed. Okay. I so wish I hadn't. Last, time, <laughs> last time she went up there, she was absolutely fine. This time she cried like a baby. I didn't cry. You weren't far off. You weren't far off crying. Yeah, because you almost collapsed the ladder. And then I threw a tin down at you. Why? He's putting the LED lights on. So yeah, this is right obviously... Who's no. this? Look. Oh, it's not plugged in. That's I'm just going to go down it's not switched on. Here you go. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so we just put the LEDs on, that's what Lee was trying to do, but he switched up to the wall. Um, so yeah, we're just literally 
we've got rid of the bed. Obviously, we just gave it to the next door neighbour. She wanted it. So, <laughs> yeah, it's out of our way. We didn't pay a lot for it, did we? Nah. I think, how much did we pay for it? To be honest, I think it was about 20 or 30 quid. I don't, yeah. it wasn't. So, if you remember, it was an elderly lady. And her, her parents had died, didn't they? Her mum. It was a bungalow, wasn't it? Yeah. Somewhere. Was Hastings it Way? Was it, oh, I think it was Dartford. No, it was Hastings Way. But that's all I remember. And I, I said to her, are you sure about the price? Because like they're worth... Um, a fortune. They're worth about 1,500 quid or nearly two grand at the time. Um, but she was one of them people, you know, her mum, her mum meant everything to her um, and she just wanted everything gone. M money wasn't uh, money. Money wasn't the object. She just wanted it out of the house. Um, or out the bungalow, um, and if you remember, there was loads of stuff. But unfortunately, we didn't know because there was a load of other stuff that we would have had. And the woman said you could have had whatever you wanted here. And she said, but unfortunately, most of it has all gone. Mm. Um, we only that uh, she only we only knew because she put the bed up. It was a lovely bungalow, as an as well, wasn't it? Yeah, it's like I'll add the bungalow and all if you're. <laughs> if you're letting it go. So yeah, it was it was a twin adjust. Uh, Twin adjustable double bed, but obviously we wanted a new one because we thought we'd treat ourselves when we decorated our room. We've so never we've never had a new of bed. Us have ever had a new bed. A brand spanking new bed. So it's always been hand me downs and stuff that people's kind of gifted us, so to speak. So yeah, we're really really looking forward to it, and it's got a TV in the bed end as well, so Lee can plug his PlayStation into it. Or I can cast YouTube from my iPad onto it. So, yeah. So that's it. I'm going to get the kids tea in a minute. And then, obviously, we'll be um, ending the vlog. The next... <laughs> the next morning. Jumping into the next day, guys. Sorry we forgot to end the vlog last night. It was a bit of a hectic... Let me turn around. A bit of a hectic... Um, evening wasn't it it was um and dfs are currently upstairs installing our new bed which we're proper excited about well lee's not i am you're not excited you're just a grinch aren't you go to bed alone <laughs> <laughs> give, give over sleep. I don't get. so once that's done obviously they've gone obviously we'll show you and that'll be our room finished then right guys so we've got our new bed it's all been assembled they've gone and cleared off Left all the rubbish, uh, which I'm a bit disappointed about. Luckily, yeah. it's our recycling. I'll have to check the, check the terms and conditions, because I'm sure that's what you pay that installation charge for, is because they install it, you know, and if we had the old bed, they're supposed to take the old bed away as well. Yeah. So why have they left us with all the rubbish? So I'm going to give you a tour of our finished bedroom now. Hold on. So are you ready, guys? So, this is our new bed. Don't worry, it's not broken. Obviously, it's an adjustable <laughs> one. And it's crushed velvet. And it's got... It'll be crushed velvet by the time I've sat on it. <laughs> <laughs> Just, um, like, gems in the headboard. And then, obviously, I'll get Lee to show you, obviously... Oh, babe, do I have to go on camera? Why? Look at we'll me. Look, I'm sweating like a pig okay, that's about we'll to get on. roasted. Right. So, we're going to show you the TV. Okay. So, for La Pista Resistance, as they say, <laughs> watch very carefully. And then, obviously, we'll, we'll have a TV. No, we're going to put a big sign on it, so every morning we're going to pop it up and it's going to turn around and say, Wakey, wakey! <laughs> <laughs> you have filming to do. <laughs> so, yeah, so obviously you could attach your TV to it and it goes down into the bed thing. We've got which, to try and find one. Which, knowing Louise, we'll probably show you that in a couple yep. of hours' time because that ain't going to stay without a TV on there for very long. I'll yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna go and see if I can get a TV for it. <laughs> Um, we're not quite sure. We're a bit confused about the measurements yeah. on the it, it on the nice. website, but it looks really nice. It looks um, about eighty three, about eighty three millimeters. 
It's got to be a slim line tally, but I think. Obviously, as you can see, that one is put up. Um, I'll show you. I'll show you this one because this is Lee's one. Is it the two middle ones? To put it by both up together. Uh, yeah. So you just basically push these two. You middle can do them individually. You can do them individually, obviously, like Lee's just said. But you just push these two ones here. These two ones. <laughs> these half ones and then it just literally like and it also lifts up as well whoa that mattress actually popped off the base huh what? that mattress popped off the base oh yeah because of the yeah because you've got no weight on it so um so yeah if you want to put it back down so this one's going to be good this one's going to be good for Lee because obviously it actually hires up, doesn't it? Yeah, it'll probably be better anyway. This is actually lower than our old bed, so I've got to see how well I do this one. getting into it. Yeah, so that's that. Louise's mattress and put it on top of mine. So we just got to, obviously, <laughs> you excuse the state, I ain't even dressed yet. You um, sure? Feel me naked? <laughs> well, I'm, I'm still in my jammers. <laughs> Behave yourself, you. And then obviously, Lee's got a remote there. Oh, hang on. I also forgot to tell you, not only have you got a wireless remote for the TV, yep, one. you've also got a wired, a wired one. Why well, you'd want two, I don't know. Maybe some if you lose people one. ain't lazy ass like us. <laughs> <laughs> some people don't mind getting up and actually. So then just press the down button. Yeah. And there it goes. No, what who says the anything that doesn't it doesn't do? It does, look, I've worked it out there. No, it doesn't. <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> Whose side's which? This is my side. Um so yeah, this is my side and that is the only downside. What? Uh -huh. what? So I'm going to put mine down. Right. Right, so. But it's way too low. Press the down button. Yeah. Right, I'll hold this up. I'll press the down button. And you have to push the mattresses right. down. Now listen. Yeah, this is the only downside to the TV. Listen. If you don't push. It doesn't actually cancel. Yeah. Mm. If you on its own, push you down. have to press. You have to push stop. the stop button. I don't Otherwise, know. that will be going. I don't know if you heard that tapping noise. Twenty-four hours a day, seven days a week. That do my brain. Just that just that days, yeah. Yeah. Why do you have to just be like mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. like that? Excuse me <laughs> while I beat up your room. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Oh, and we've got lights everywhere. And lights everywhere. And then <laughs> we've got this one. See, we've one. got this one, but we don't like that bit. So we just yeah. turn that one off. <laughs> this one is really cool. Can't even see it. So yeah, obviously we'll be back once I've bought the TV and made the bed and so everything. So we're sitting about half hour. <laughs> and obviously then I'll film it for you guys. Right guys, so I'm back from B&M and I've got everything that I wanted. Um, new quilt, new pillars and everything like that. Um, we've got a TV for our bed over there. But they didn't supply the bolts to mount it to the bracket. Now we found the bolts after so long because I had to go and buy them from Screwfix. But now, obviously, their bolts are too small and slip straight through the hole of the bracket. So now, <laughs> now Lee is improvising with a washer um, because we haven't got any tiny washers. Have you? You got any in the shed? I haven't got a clue what I've got, but I can't afford to come look. You're so lazy. Mm. So, I've got to go out there anyway, so I've got to put all the stuff back in the shoe. Ah! I broke that. Okay, that was no good. That was no good. So, yeah, that's Bobby. the end of the vlog for today, guys. Once it's all sorted and everything, then we will kind of give you a, give you a tour and everything and show you what it looks like. But, yeah, it's proving <laughs> a bit of a pain in the backside. Fun, fun, So... Fun. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And we will see you again next time. Can you say bye? Bye-bye. See you later, people. Bye, guys.